inside former CSI star Gary Durden's life struggles, arrests, bankruptcy and brother's mysterious death. Former CSI, crime scene investigation star Gary Durden had a brilliant and promising career ahead of him after starring as the forensic investigator Warwick Brown. But since his breakthrough, Gary Durden has faced numerous trials, bankruptcy, and many other struggles in life. He even disappeared from the silver screen for a long period, and the reason might not surprise you. The multifaceted actor certainly had many interests as a young man, he was good at athletics, played music, and loved breakdance. After leaving New Jersey, Gary moved to New York City to work as a doorman at a rehearsal studio. She cast him as Shaza Zulu on the popular sitcom A Different World. Gary acted as her love interest in the music video for the song Again, a song that became huge at the time. When I got on the show, it was a great challenge to be an actor and to be in a drama. You want to be able to play a character who has dimensions. And I was able to do that, Gary told Red Carpet News. In the opening scene of season 9, viewers watched how Warwick died in the arms of colleague and friend Gil Grissom. Gary Durden, who has African American, Native American, Franco Haitian Jewish, Irish, and Scottish ancestry, had a brief marriage with model Rosumba Williams in the early 90s. The couple tied the knot in 1992 but got divorced in 1994. As mentioned, Gary has faced many struggles in life, but the worst thing that happened to him was a family tragedy that remains unsolved. The 23-year-old Daryl Durden had traveled to Haiti to do research on the family lineage but never returned home. Gary has been in trouble with the law several times during his career and life. In June 2011, he was arrested after driving his car into parked vehicles. As if that were not enough, Gary also had significant financial problems. In August 2012, he filed for bankruptcy. At the time, the CSI's favorite had at just over $1.8 million and owned his creditors approximately $1.7 million. To me, Gary was the best in CSI, after Warwick died, CSI wasn't CSI anymore. After all the struggles he has been through, I am delighted to see how Gary seems to feel today and that he does what he loves, acting.